What's good, YouTube? It's your boy Bugs back on another NBA 2K20 My Team video. Guys, today we actually do have some market talk. As you guys been wondering, I you're like, yo, Bugs, you didn't post it at 12. I'm sorry, yo. It's a little late. I know. I had to do some personal things. But yeah, guys, we got some uh, market talk today. I'm gonna go over a ton of players, what you should do with your cards, what you should do, make that MT. All that good stuff, guys. As for usual, make sure to drop 20,000 in the comments, like the vid, and sub if you are new for a chance at winning 20,000 MT. And uh, yeah, my giveaway winner from the other day was Bryce Mendez, or is it Brian Mendez? I don't know. Something Mendez, but it be. Um, let me know. Uh, hit up my DMs for a chance of winning that 20,000 MT, because you did win. You're one of my OGs. I actually did a random pick, but honestly... Uh, you were one of them. You're actually pretty OG. So make sure to smash that uh, Make sure to hit me up in my DMS on Twitter or whatever and guys Let's get this video to a hundred likes to win that 20,000 MT. We've been rocking and rolling with the MC giveaways So let's keep it going <coughs> And guys, um, we're gonna go over the market a lot of you guys have been wondering What's going on with the market? My Amis are not doing well. We'll go over it all in this video, okay? You have to realize that packs did drop yesterday, so a lot of things are going to go up in value. Honestly, the market's still pretty crashed, but let's go over my Amethyst 20s. Let's check it out. I'll let you know what's going on with that. Uh, honestly, they did rise a little bit because I got most of mine for 12K. They're around 15-ish, 14-ish. So, all right, listen, it's they're not going to rise a lot. Honestly, this week might be a really bad week because... Right now, it doesn't look like they're going to rise too much. They're probably going to rise to around 17, 18. You're still going to make some MT. It's just you're not going to make a lot. As much as I used to make, I feel like the market crash kind of destroyed this filter. I'm not even going to lie to you guys. This filter might have just been destroyed by the stupid market crash. I don't know, though. It could maybe maybe they'll go back up next week. I don't know, because you have to realize they did release a ton of content. That's probably why they're really cheap. Like The content they released... This week was honestly, it was so good that it made the market crash so bad. So it's honestly not my fault. I did not know they would release like four packs in one week. So honestly, my fault to you guys. But honestly, you're still going to make some MT. You're definitely going to make some MT. So definitely don't be down on yourself. Wait till Sunday, bro. Sunday night, they might drop up to 17, 18. You'll make like 3K a pop. So don't worry. You're still going to make MT. Just trust me. Alright, so let's get into my dime filter. Supposedly, a lot of cards are really cheap right now. So, it, it's not a bad time to buy still. The market is pretty crashed. Honestly, the market is very crashed. I would honestly recommend buying a ton of cards. Not even going to lie. Let's see. Look at this, dude. Willis Reed was literally 30k yesterday. 35k. Dude, this Latrell for that cheap is a snag. Austin Cart. Honestly, bro, the market's way crashed right now. I saw, I got a Daryl Griffith. For 30, no, 26k yesterday. He's rocking around 40k. Yo, market is so crashed. Today is a great day to buy. Literally a great day. If you see, if you see diamonds for under 30k, you know the market's crashed. I don't even have to say anything. Dominique for 30k. I don't have MT. That is such a snipe. It bothers me. Oh my god. Yo, if you see that Dominique right now, legacy cards are so cheap. The Spotlight Series cards. Legacy cards. If you see any of them for under 30k diamond, make sure to buy them out because you're gonna make thousands of MT. That Dominique Wilkins, he's probably not that expensive, but his price will rise, bro. He's out of packs for a really long time. I don't know why the market is so laggy, bro. If you've been having, I've been having a lot of 2k problems. Like I don't know, the market's been super laggy ever since they dropped new content. A lot of people have been on the game, I guess. But yeah, we just saw a Dominique for 30. He's rocking around 38, but yo, you have to <clears throat> you have to realize he's out of packs. What that means is, bro, he's just going to go up the value. He's probably going to go up to 45, 50k. It's a Diamond Dominique Wilkins. His stats are amazing. He's got clamps. He's got threes. He can do anything. He can rebound. He can dunk. He is, he's fast. He can do anything. He can shoot. So you have to realize, that card right there for 30k is a great snipe. Pretty much anything under 25k Diamond is a snipe. Anything you see... Especially in the Spotlight Challenge, the Spotlight Series collections, like anything, bro. If you see any Spotlight Challenge card for under 30k diamond, you must buy it because they are out of packs. That is one method to you guys. Any pack, legacy cards, anything you see for under 30k. Like this Latrell for 27k, he's going to sell for at least 35, at least. That's at least 4 or 5k made, at least. So this isn't a bad card tonight. You just want to wait. 
you honestly this is probably one of the best filters right now for some reason there's a ton of diamonds going off for the low that dominique was a great snipe i would literally pick that up i have no mc where's all my mc you ask i have a Giannis, and i have all these bro i'm waiting for the market to go up a little bit to sell these to make a ton of mc like it's so annoying bro why is my face can't have to bug it's just come on bro it's so annoying but yeah you know what i'm saying so i don't know right now right now i'm honestly confused i'm kind of annoyed it's just like we have to wait for the auction to like it's annoying bro we have to wait for the auction to come back sunday could be the day sunday might not be the day if sunday's not the day it has to be monday morning that's the only problem like i'm literally kind of annoyed right now how the market is so crashed still honestly right now bro honestly i would recommend buying cards but then again they're gonna drop moments monday if they drop moments monday we're back at a1 we're back at another market crash so honestly i'm confused i'm very confused right now i'm not gonna lie to any of you guys all my supporters i'm i'm seriously kind of confused so let's go over earl monroe in the meantime let's see what his price is Let's go. I'm just going to go over a bunch of cars, honestly, for the rest of this video. Um, all the Earl Monroe's. I've got all mine for 8K and under. They're around 13. Honestly, not a bad time to sell. That's one card I could say you could you could sell and be happy about. So he's at 12.3, 12.4. I think it was about 13K. Not a bad card to sell. Uh, let me think. What else do we got? The Amethyst 20s. I said, wait, what other cars do we have? We got Diamond. Oh, how can I forget? So we got all the Spotlight Series cards. that They were in packs. I think they're out of packs now. Let's check out Diamond LeBron. Diamond LeBron I saw was really cheap. Ooh, I actually just saw one sell for 140 about an hour ago. Literally, a 140. Now he's at 176. So if you did get him for that 140, I swear, I swear, to bro. I got him, I saw him for 140K, right? Now he's 176. That makes me think. It looks like some diamond cards are starting to rise. So that's good. If you did get some spotlight diamonds like Giannis, Joe Dumars, uh, even Amethyst, Kobe, Mello, you're going to make a lot of MC. Let's see. Pink diamond. Let's see Joe Dumars. Joe Dumars was rocking around 50K. He's a pink diamond. He has clamps. He can shoot threes. Let's see. Joe Dumars is probably, if you get him for 50K or under, that's my, that's my method. 50K or under, get him and sell him later. That's what I would do. And I looks like the market's bugged. I don't know, dude. 2K has been super laggy. Dude, I saw him for 50K earlier. Now he's around 56. 55K and under is a good price. He's going to rise up to 70K. He's out of packs for a while. Even if stuff drops, he might go down a little bit. Then he's going to rise. He's not a bad car to buy. I got Carmelo for literally 20K in one of my videos. I'm pretty sure he's rocking around 30-something. He's still going to go up. I think he's going to go up to at least 40K. That Kobe... Amethyst Carmelo. I got I could have got both of them for 22k. I had no MT. They are wrote they wrote blah, they rose up to about 36, 37. Melo's about 35. Alright, so he's about 35k. I got mine for 20k on the dot. I'll make about 11 to 12k clean right now. And I'm still waiting. So honestly, you guys could sell some cars now. Uh personally, I'm waiting. I literally I don't believe in selling the cars right now. It's too early. It's just the only problem is, bro. If we actually have moments dropping, which I think we do, like these are going two days today, Saturday. The only problem is, bro, if Monday we could have a big market crash and we could be like really sad, we could honestly get destroyed by another market crash. That's the only problem. But tomorrow is a day I'm going to post a video on market overview. I'm going to tell you exactly what to do. So stay tuned for that. Right now, if you have any spotlights, to be honest, Spotlight Giannis, Spotlight LeBron. You could honestly sell now. I'm not even going to lie. The spotlights are a clear sell now. Everything else is iffy. I don't know why, dude. Like, did, I guess these packs were really that good. But yeah, right now, if you have any spotlights. If you have Spotlight Giannis too. I heard he was going for a buyout of 100k. He's actually around... I think you could get a bid out of him. Let's see. You could probably get a bit out of the, the Spotlight Giannis too. So you could probably go and sell him too. You probably got him for around, a, ooh, 100K, yeah. 100K buy now. So he's dropped. He's probably one of the only cards that didn't really rise. He's the only one that really dropped. But honestly, for 100K, I feel like you could get a bit out of him when the Moments 1 goes up though. So when the Moments 1 goes up, you do have a pretty good chance of making that MT. But honestly, that's really all I got for you guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. I hope I answered a lot of questions. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments. 
That's really all I got. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Let me know, guys. Hope you have a good one. Peace.